I'm Dr. Flexlot. Now, the man we just showed you, I'm assuming that you either don't want to ever end up like that man, or you already are that man, and you don't want to be anymore. Which is very understandable. Well, I have good news for you. I have three steps that you can take to, hopefully, improve your mental health. Now, step one is meditation, and I don't mean the meditation like the, um, that's a totally different meditation. What I mean is just merely getting yourself into a comfortable position, relaxing, and just generally being more aware of what kind of thoughts are going through your head. I'd also like to add that a very useful app to get into meditation is Headspace. I'm not sponsored by them, but I mean, if they want to give me some money so I can feed my kids, I appreciate it. The next step is to then limit your social media use. Social media on its own isn't bad, however, overdoing it can give you rose-colored glasses of how the world looks. This can cause you to become depressed if you look at the more depressing areas of the internet and social media. Now, step three is to stay healthy physically as well as mentally. If you are physically healthy, you will have a better perception of yourself, and then you will gain confidence, and confidence can be very good for your mental health. Exercising also releases endorphins, which therefore will make you happy. Thank you for watching this PSA all the way through, and I hope these three steps help you improve your own mental health. I mean, it helped Harold! Thanks to Dr. Dabinbottom's uh, three tips, I don't want to fall into a dark abyss for the rest of eternity! <laughs> Harold, I think he needs some actual mental help, and if you're like Harold, please get some yourself.